Alright, we're back and we have space. I deleted some of the trash from previous episodes. Yeah. Trash. Oh, wait. Of course, wait. Gosh darn it. Wait. We need to eat it to be heavy for it to extend more. I think it could if you just place rubber bands, I think it could make it simpler because yeah, the other shock doesn't really do anything at this point. Or maybe I could make it do stuff by adding more weights. Because weights are the way to go. Yeah, more, more weights probably. Oh gosh. No, no. The rubber band have bugged out. No, you do not dare bug out. Rubber band, you do not dare. Or is it the rubber band? The yep, it's the rubber band that bugged out. Dang it, rubber band, you do not bug out like that. Yeah, not enough weights. So, lesson learned do not connect it to rubber band because rubber band likes bugging out. More weights. It's really odd that we're adding weights to a sp exotic sports car. Hmm. Maybe in, in automation or probably in any other cars, you act you actually add weights for stabilizers and I think we need to just increase this a tiny bit. Still no Still no play No play no game Fine I increase your actual length a tiny bit How about if I lower coefficient? lower coefficient even more okay there you go okay i think we need to increase coefficient just a tiny bit 200 hmm yeah it works that works that works too now for the rear suspension Mm-hmm. Probably do the same. Except there's no weights this time, so lower coefficient it is then. Oh, we could have done that. Lower the increase the coefficient. And we do not need to have place the weights. Let's do this. Not oh, not enough coefficient. Too high of pressure, I think. Oh my gosh, darn it! I forgot about pressure. So, if we could remove these weights and all the heavy things over here, though it does add stability, but we could have added pressure on this plate. Very high coefficient. This one will do. Maybe lower the pressure a bit more. Too low of pressure. Too low. Still too low. Maybe it's it's either that or the cut. Or the rubber band does not have enough force acting on it, so let's add a secondary rubber band. There you go. Yeah, it's gonna bottom out good because that's not what we want. There you go. Okay, we need more press, less coefficient for the second band. Find max pressure this then. What what we can do actually is we could increase the pressure for this thing so that when we lower it, it does that. Maybe increase the pressure that much. So now it could drop 
like so yeah we need more pressure more 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 maybe very little coefficient for this one yes it plays a lot and when we drop it very low right height good maybe you know what compromise let's increase the pressure there will still be play but it's gonna be lower to the ground oh wait we need to lower the actual length there you go very stable and if we place the platform it has play very nice Mm -hmm. Then we could increase pressure to max. Never mind, not max. Huh? Maybe just tiny bit. Eh, just a tiny bit less. There you go. So, how much play does this give us? A lot. <laughs> Uh, it's not sporty as I expected though, so let's lower pressure for front shock. Yay! It's very soft shocks are not probably not the way to go because it increases body roll by a lot. Mm, maybe that will do. So first we have to uh, lower, compress the suspension as much as possible. Is it the same if I compress the suspension as much as possible? Or does it act differently? I have no idea. And let's continue the, with the rear, with the rear of the car. Heh, <laughs> I don't have a timer set up so I don't know how much time I've, I've used up solving that problem but eh. More time, right? More, more time, the better, right? So I could um, reach that 10 minute sweet, sweet 10 minute mark. That sounds selfish, but yeah. This is probably why you do not want to buy a very sport, a very sporty car for your daily driver, because it has very bad rides. I mean, if you're in a, in a track, then fine, buy one of these guys, but for normal street driving use, <laughs> for the, if you're, you're gonna use your car from, to go from point A to point B, then no, if you have that much money and you're using your cars to go from point A to point B, then you'd be better off buying a, a Camry or something. Something more comfortable than something that's not as something that's more forgiving than this thing because yeah it's absolutely not forgiving at all. Hmm, what do we want the rear to look like? We want to make it look nice, nice. <laughs> that's a definite. We definitely want to make this look nice, so there you go. Nice sporty back. Then, do you want to make this conf convertible? Don't think so. so then, uh, this thing just po the line just pauses here. Uh, oh, it does not really pause, but hey, guess it's the right term now. Then we lower everything everything at once we, it's lowered no maybe 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 the line should be like this oh gosh it's so heavy the body panels are so heavy just realized no no everything we do not want everything to be heavy we want this part of the car to be light because it's a sports car not a heavy tow truck it's not your farmer's uh, breadwinner it's a sports car 
it needs to be light and nimble and then we add another plastic beam maybe larger and then it meets up with the wheel arch over here there you go that looks nice if probably not as nice as those exotic sports car but it does look pretty nice if i say so myself enzo will be so proud of me not really let's lower this thing this thing though this is just a weird bulge so it's a weird bulge in front of the car so let's fix that real quick let's make the let's not make this a weird bulge instead we make this a arch for the duke of weaselton let's not make this look that bad so let's give it a curve like this there you go and maybe a part where it dives like that maybe more of a dive like that yep and like every single not we're not done with the front end yet Uh, it's going to be I don't know what I don't know what look we're going for here maybe Italian or something let's make it cheese wedge because that's all the everybody wants right let's make it look absolutely like the Prius with a cheese wedge design because that looks fab personally I like the Prius personally there's nothing really wrong with the Prius aside from everybody hating on it. Prius is a good car. It saves, it does guzzles less gas than the average car. So, I guess it's a good car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This one's heavy. Which means the hood is so heavy too. No, we do not want this to be heavy at all. We want this to be super darn lightweight I should have made the body before before setting the suspension up because now the the suspension will act differently because the weights have changed changed replace beam and then we color it blue do we do we want panoramic sunroof? I mean it makes stuff heavier but panoramic sunroof guys mm. hmm nah panoramic sunroof is probably too heavy for this car there you go that looks ridiculously sporty with that I think this one's way too high. Way too high. Let's lower that a tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. Let's lower all of this just a bit lower like that. That should do. There you go. A very nice rear. And the infamous no visibility glass at the back and there you go here's our sports car yep totally acts differently now wow that is slow let's go and increase the right order by a couple thousand that is slow maybe we need to make give it higher torque yep that's his top speed this thing is too heavy a Chevy could beat it my 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 let's add a bit more weight to it because that's how we roll
Mm, I don't, you know what? I have no idea how feeling this would work with plastic beams. Uh, let's just see if it will work. Let us see. So you only want to connect it to the body panel. By the way, the density is so low, this is pretty much carbon fiber, and yet it's heavy. Roger? Nope. 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 No, I want this plank to... Nope. Yeah, there. Finally. Nope. 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 No. No. Mm. Fine. And it's way heavier now. Now we place another plank. Like inside. Wedge the plank. Wait, maybe before that it might be wise to give this a plank. Over here. Maybe another. Nope. Maybe one over here. Yeah, that works. Nope. 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 No, 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 no. You go here. No, you go there. Yes, there. No, not in. Oh, no. Well, it was nice trying to decorate this car. How about if you lower the size? Like a bunch. Lower its size. Oh. Okay. Let's calm down. Let's lower the size. And I don't know. It might be better without the thing. Mm -hmm. But guys, just pretend it's pure white or something. Like everything over there is covered up by nice, nice paneling. Ah, I'll give up. There's our car. Hope you like this car. It does wheelies. That's how fast the car is. You need more speed. And here we go, and there goes the car. I hope you like this vid. Please watch. Uh, it's quite fast, so I think I made good car. Wait, I didn't test the suspension yet. Let's test if it is a very good car. So let's give this car the supercar owner's worst fear. Uh, ramps like that type of ramp which pretty much kills the car instantly wait I forgot to put a front splitter which is like what every supercar one needs a front splitter to make it easier to damage the vehicle should be good there you go the front split the front lip Continues on like this quite large front lip There you go Should we add do you a huge wing maybe Now this is quite fast That's no joke. Uh, that's no question. It's quite fast And yes as I expected it crashes mm -hmm. Look Look, it's not gonna make it because of the front splitter. 
is guys this is why you do not buy supercar for your daily driver if you want daily driver buy mercedes a mercedes suv a mercedes coupe suv a crossover a camry something that's not a supercar basically a nova could be good could be not there you go and car goes onto ramp there you go see it can't even move anymore because the front splitter catches the thing can I back up into that will it clear hopefully it does because it's a supercar and internal storage is full so I guess I have to end the video here bye Peace out.